Well, as I indicated from the tee here on the 18th hole at True Blue, I pushed my tee shot, but I managed to get it in the right side of the fairway. There's only one problem here. As you can see, I've got to hit over this mound, can't see the flag, and I really don't know where I'm going. So the easiest way to be able to make yourself more comfortable with what you're trying to attempt here is to walk up the hill, find out where your flag is, okay? And this one's in the front left of the green near the lake. Fortunately, as from here I can see, there's a big mound to the right that's gonna be a backstop for me. Well, what I'm going to do now that I know where the flag is, I've got a birdhouse behind the green. I've got a big tall pine tree back there as well. If I go just to the right of the birdhouse, about 12 yards right of that big tall pine, I'm going to catch the right portion of the green to be able to get this ball to run down to the flag. I've got 137 yards, I'm slightly into the wind, and I've got an 8 iron, just something nice and smooth, just because, you know, I can't see where I'm going, I don't want to make myself more uncomfortable than I already am. So I want to try to trust my target, what I've picked out, and by doing so, I'm going to stand here, look behind my ball, I've got a divot just right here in front of my ball, and I'm going to try to shoot and aim right over that. If I can hit this shot over that ball, I should be, over that divot, excuse me, I should be fine. Got it on the green, I'm about 15 feet just to the right of the flag. Whenever you get into these situations where you have a blind shot and you're not comfortable, find a target to aim at. Find something in front of your ball, whether it's an old divot like this one, a piece of grass, a bit of sand, whatever it is, something that you can aim over to give you the confidence to know that's where you're trying to hit this ball. It will help you to calm down, relax, make a good smooth golf swing, and put that ball on the green.